What is up guys? I'm Uriel Soto and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to make an icon tab just like so. And you are able to use images as well. Now this was requested by Ravi, a fellow subscriber. Now if you're interested in learning how to build this cool looking tab, go ahead and stick around. So let's begin. The first thing that we need to do is download a plugin. So head over to your dashboard, then go to plugins, and then click on add new. And then go ahead and search for a plugin called Essential Add-ons for Elementor. And you're going to go ahead and install this one. And then activate it. Now from here, we're going to go to our page that we want to add our tabs. So I'm going to go into uh, my home page here and I'm going to click on edit with Elementor. And then I'm going to choose a spot where I want to add my tabs. So I'm going to go ahead and remove this, this uh, little widget right there. And then I'm going to go ahead and search for tabs. And then I'm going to grab this tab that's, that's called the advanced tabs. So I'm just going to drag it and place it where I want my tabs. Now, as you can tell off the bat, we already have icons here. Now, uh, well, what I want to do is change the icons to maybe a specific image that I want, that I want to use. And I also want to use uh, an Elementor template for my tab as well. So I'm going to go into content here, and then we're going to go ahead and work on our first tab here. So I'm going to choose an image instead of an icon. But you are able to just click on this icon box and choose any icon that you would like. Um, you can you can choose anything here, but I'm going to go ahead and choose a pick a uh, image So I'm going to go ahead and click on this image here, and then I'm going to choose this image that I have here Actually, I'm going to go ahead and just grab a quick image here So I'm going to go and grab some illustrations here, and I'm just gonna just gonna grab these random illustrations So I'm going to download them um, as a PNG and then I'm going to go ahead and download um, this one as a PNG. And then I'm going to go ahead and just use those there. So I'm going to go ahead and just um, go to my downloads here. And I'm going to see if I can just use any of those images here. So I'm just going to choose this one. Now, if there is a background to it, um, which there might be, it looks like there's a background to it. That's fine. You know what? We're going to choose this one for right now, just so then we don't have a background. So I'm going to use that one there. I'm going to use this image here. And then over here, where it says content, I'm going to go ahead and use a saved template. And then I'm going to go ahead and choose my tab one that I made specifically for this video. So I'm going to use that for my first tab. Now we just need to make some adjustments here. Now I'm just going to go through every single one here. And I'm going to add um, saved template here. And I'm going to choose tab two. Now I'm not really going to change um, the icon here to an image because I think you guys kind of get the gist of it So I don't really need to do every single um, tab here. So I think those are all set now I'm gonna go into my settings here. I'm gonna go to my general settings and Then I'm gonna go ahead and you can also stack these as well. If that was something that we wanted to do Or we can go to style here and we'll go to tab title and then go to icon size and then just go ahead and make the size a lot larger and then I'm going to have it about that size. I think that's a good size there. You can also adjust the gap as well. But I mean, to be honest, I don't really need the text here. I already have my icons and I think the icon can already paint a picture there. But if I did want to, I can have this vertical and or I can have it horizontal and then I can have these stacks. So I can also have the titles at the bottom, which actually works a lot better instead. But you can also remove the titles as well. So you can go into any individual tab and just remove the title here. Now I actually do like how that looks without the title. That's just my preference, but that is entirely up to you. So I'm going to go ahead and just remove the titles of each tab. So now we have every single tab set up, but we kind of have an issue here. I mean, um, our uh, Elementor template, it looks kind of squished. So we need to adjust the, the width on here. So what I'm going to choose, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and click on my section here. And then where it says content width, I'm just going to expand my width all the way down, probably to about that size. So then my Elementor template can fit perfectly. Now, as you can tell, that is looking just great here. 
Now I did just choose a um, default Elementor block. So of course these don't probably look the best, but I'm sure you guys can change it up and have it go with your website style. So um, that is pretty much it for this video. If you guys did enjoy this video, make sure to like and subscribe to the channel. It'll definitely help us out a lot. And as always, thanks for watching and I'll catch you guys in the next video.